climber. If you slip, your hands can't hold you. You're gonna die. Anybody could conceivably die on any given day. Soloing makes it feel far more immediate and much more present. Here is what I don't understand. One little mistake, one little slip, and you fall and die. You seem to understand it well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> El Cap is obsessed with generations of climbers. Here we are. 3,200 feet of sheer granite. I mean, possibly the hardest big wall in the world. Oh, there it is. Pretty exciting. The idea of climbing El Cap, it's like, oh, would you like to do that? And I've always been like, you're like, yes, for sure. I think everybody who has made free soloing a big part of their life is dead now. I was too afraid to talk to strangers. So I was doing a lot of soloing. Maybe I just suck. I work through the fear until it's just not scary anymore. No matter how well I ever do at anything, it's not that good. Bottomless pit of self loathing It's definitely the motivation for some so long. Hey Jimmy, you copy. You just started climbing. It's so slippery right there. Right now. He's moving fast. He just did the hollow flake down climb and is in the hollow flake now. That is really too gnarly. It's so exposed. I can't believe you guys actually didn't watch. <laughs>